never change to make it look different, only to make it work better. That was a commercial for the Volkswagen Beetle, a car seen on roadways from Germany to California for more than 80 years. But the Beetle's long ride is about to come to an end. In March, VW announced it's planning to end production of the iconic model. That won't change the love many owners have for their bugs, however, or the lively business at one of the few auto shops dedicated exclusively to repairing them. Don Daler paid them a visit. <laughs> They are the humblest of cars. Designed in Germany in the 1930s, they gained popularity as part of the 60s counterculture. Volkswagen Beetles are notoriously underpowered, offered with no frills, a basic design that didn't markedly change for decades. But they are arguably the most popular cars in history. Once ubiquitous on America's highways, bugs are now a cherished rarity. <laughs> Just ask these proud owners taking part in an annual fall foliage cruise on the East Coast, organized by Chris Vallone. We had 50 cars and probably 85, 90 people showed up. People come from all over the country. I have a guy that flies in from California every year to do that cruise. This is a beauty. Yeah, 1962 convertible. Vallone is himself a bug fanatic. With his father, Chris Sr., he runs classic VW Bugs in Congers, New York, perhaps the only restoration shop in the world dedicated solely to the lowly beetle. What is it like for you when you find that, that hidden treasure somewhere yeah. that's a barn find or has just been sitting in the guy's field forever? It's magical. It really is, because you just don't see much of them anymore. But to find something like that in a barn, it's just so cool. For Valone, this 1968 Volkswagen Beetle was the one that started it all. $350 later, I bought that and brought it home to my dad. I said, I think we're going to restore this one. Let's give it a shot. What is it about the bug that, that appealed to you? That happy look on his face. It's got a face when you look at it, right? It's got the little smile, that bumper there. They're still a very safe vehicle. Yeah, for the most part. They had little knowledge of auto mechanics at the time, but over the years, the Valones have managed to grow classic VW bugs into the destination for bug enthusiasts looking to have their baby restored or looking to buy one already transformed to showroom quality. How long would it usually take you, though, to restore one of these? It depends, you know, how bad the car is. If it's a real rust bucket, sometimes it would be six months, eight months, a year. Is it difficult to get parts for things that are 50 years plus old? You know, thank God for the internet. It was said internet, specifically eBay, that got the word out about the Valone shop. Now they have a two-year waiting list for cars that once upon a time cost as little as $1,500. What do some of these high-end restorations go for now? An old one, like a 54 or 55, something like that. You're talking 40, 50, 60 thousand dollars, 65 thousand dollars. Um, a split window, I've seen split windows, 70, 75. <laughs> Why do you think though that people are still drawn to these? The nostalgia, the history, people want their youth back and they want those memories back. Something the lucky few who never gave up those memories can understand. Even this reporter, who still owns the bright red beetle his parents drove off the lot in 1967 for $2,000. For CBS This Morning Saturday, Don Daler, Congers, New York. Good for Don. Yes. Man, that's I so love cool. those cars. My dad had one. Lime, although it was like a pale yellow Volkswagen Beetle, and I hated getting into it as a kid because it, it was like no frills, and you could smell the gasoline burning in the back. You know, they think the engine was like, was the engine in the, in the, the back of the yeah, car? Yeah, I think it was. I think it was I in the back were, of the yeah. car, you know, but he should have kept it. Uh, I'd probably be looking styling. Drove one once and just smiled the whole time. <laughs>